Hello guys, my name is Eric Van Wilderman, and welcome back to Beyond Two Souls. So as you can see, we started exactly where we left off last time. We're walking right into this big condenser thing that was opened up. And uh, shit is hitting the fan, and we're seeing a bunch of dead people, and... Is, Did you hear that? Oh my god, it was an accident. Don't yeah, listen yeah, don't listen. Keep going. Just keep going. It, it, seriously, it's, there's nothing we can do. We just gotta get there and end it all. Dead people. Dead people, come on. Do you even have ears? Seriously, do you even have ears? God damn it. It's pretty obvious who they are. You know, they're dead people. It's like, oh, forgive me, I shouldn't have happened. Who are they? Durr. After all the things that you know, you really had to ask, who are they? Really? Well, anyways, rant over, okay? <laughs> Let's just keep on going. Let's keep going. Don't look back. Don't look back, just push forward and ride into the sunset. Oh, it's my mom. No. My baby. No. I lost my baby. Have you seen it? Oh no, never mind. No. No. I... Who in the hell? It wasn't our mom. It looked like our stepmom a little bit. Ah oh, shit, there goes Ryan. We lost our baby now. Ryan. Our baby is gone. Ryan baby. Our baby is gone. No! Okay. Let's get to this. Is this thing close? It looks like it's close, but at the same time, it could just be an illusion. Helen, stop it. Your Helen's not here. Your Laura's not here either. I can't find them. I call them, but they don't come. Yeah, oh, he has a gun. You fool. Reason. Reason. Blame. Move. Reason. Let's Maybe use reason. It's because they don't recognize you anymore. Yeah, there you go. Look. Your anger has changed you. My, yeah. I almost spoke Korean there, I almost said Majo, which means you're right. I miss them so much! Yeah, well, come on! Just determined! I'm gonna destroy the condenser! Yeah, I'm gonna destroy it, you because asshole. You wanna stop me, you're gonna have to kill me! But, don't say that. <laughs> he might actually do it. He's crazy, he's lost his mind, he already opened up the condenser. Yeah, look at what you did, look at him, he's just standing in the middle there, like... He's gonna do it. Stop crying. Okay, you fucked up every- Oh no! Oh, he killed himself. Well, now he can be with them forever. You should have done that before you fucked everything up, okay? Jeez, Nathan. Oh, I missed yeah. I missed you so that was too perfect. That was way too perfect. Oh god, that was- <laughs> <No>. <laughs> <laughs> Kills himself. <laughs> just, just like jumps right into her arms. And you fucking wrecked it, asshole. Shut, sh 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 yeah. And you, you went crazy, and you, you could have just, oh, could have just killed yourself earlier. Jody, fuck, there you are. Hey, why'd you have to say a swear word? Okay. Could have just said Jody. There you are. He said Jody, fuck. Hey, Jody, fuck. I swear all the time, though. <laughs> Whatever, who am I to talk? Who am I to talk, Ryan? Swear all you want, I don't care. Say fun con shit, whatever you want to say. Okay? Say it a bunch. Whatever. Swearing relieves stress. And there has been, like, actual signs. Well, not signs, like, uh, research that's shown. Signs. <laughs> that uh, people that swear can be trusted more because they just let out all their anger and they're less inclined to do things like behind the scenes or whatever, so... Whatever, swearing's great! Okay, come on, Ryan, swear. Let out your stress. Okay? And it just feels good, too. It lets out stress instead of bottling it up. You just yell, fuck! Oh, hey! QT time. Okay, let's stop talking about swearing and let's just do some action. Woo! That's right, we are professional rollers, baby. Yeah! I just rolled on the floor like a badass mobile. I'm a ninja! Woo! Yeah! You know, sometimes when she's dodging, it looks like she's dancing a little bit. She's like, ooh, dancing, the dance moves. Oh, shit, stop. Stop really dancing, Eric. You gotta play this game here. Okay, show me your moves. Show me your moves. Yeah, okay. You're gonna have to do some cooler moves than that if you want to succeed, Jody. Come on. Fucking monsters. Oh, there you go. Yes, he said it. Fucking monsters. Good job. Wait, what's going on? Wait, what? Oh, that's not good. Check the panel. I'm telling you, it's not working. Fuck. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Good. Stress gone. 
Oh, he's gonna sacrifice himself. No! At least we have a chance. Oh no, those things are gonna slaughter you! Take the damn belt and destroy the fucking condenser. Oh, Ryan, you're so sweet. Sacrifice. Sacrifice. Oh, only first base? I'm sad. I was hoping for a little boob gropage. Just. It's been a long time. Okay, let's go. Okay. Let's not talk about sex or perverted things anymore. Let's just destroy the condenser. How do you destroy the condenser, may I ask? Press the X button, that's how you destroy the condenser! I bet you can hear that too, I'm just mashing away like... Hack, 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 hack. Come on! You can do it- oh no! Oh! How do we get away from things? We press the X button, that's how we do it! We inject you with a neural acid. Put you in uh, oh, he's oh he's dead. He must be dead. <laughs> exactly what we did with your mother. Ah, you're dead. It's too late. No, it's not. It's too late. Stop it. Not as long as I can keep on pressing square, okay? And then we touched the condenser. And then after touching the condenser, we let all the spirits out, but the spirits were actually happy spirits that were just in a lot of pain, and they all healed, and we all lived happily ever after. The end. Oh, not you! Come on, really? Not you! You're the last person I want to see. No, now I feel guilty. No, all the guilt is going now. Guilt, stop it. I'm sorry I killed your dad. Stop haunting me. God. Okay, gotta keep on going. Yeah, I know. Stumble. Stumble like you're drunk. Drunkenly- Oh, come on! She's... Oh, why, she's why did we turn witch. young? What did you do with witches? Oh, Burn. screw these guys! <laughs> I should've just ran out of that house when I was a high school student. Now all, all of my decisions throughout the game are coming back to haunt me. Why, game? Why? Why? I'm sick and tired of your story! Ah, I tried to kill you. <laughs> oh, they're all trying to stop me, I see. All my decisions that I made are catching up with me. Stop it! Okay, I did what I thought was right at the time. My child. Calm down, Nora. Mommy, we're doing this for you. Hey, you're still alive, Mommy. I'm gonna get you out of that coma, okay? What's going on? The twin. He strangled up cord. We couldn't There's a twin! There's a twin! Oh my god! Ah, oh, I know the... I know the twist. Aiden's gonna be the twin. Okay. Twin. My guess was totally wrong. It sucks. My guess was wrong. My brother. Aiden's your twin brother. Still born. Ooh, that's the twist. I don't know how I feel about that. So Aiden was the twin. He's lived with her his whole life. Well, so that makes sense. He was trying to protect her, but sometimes he was a bit of a prick. Oh, he's naked. We couldn't leave each other. Yeah, is that what happened? Our souls were bound together. I guess so. Wow, well, they say twins have a very special connection. I hated you for years. Yeah, you did. But he was a pal. I controlled Aiden. I wish I was Aiden. I wish it was like the gamer's Aiden. That would be cool. But now Aiden's gonna sacrifice himself to stop the condenser so Jody can live a normal life. And we're all gonna live happily ever after. So sweet. So happy. Okay, I thought we stopped the condensers. I'm gonna go bye bye now. Nope. Just more acid tripping stuff. Okay. Drugs are bad. This is what will happen. What is. What the fuck is up with this shit, huh? This is a decision making time. You gotta make a decision. Do you go into the darkness or do you go into the light? 
Well, what kind of decision is that? This isn't like some psychology test. Like some psychiatrist, like, oh, what's the good? Fuck it, we're gonna go into the light. Okay. <laughs> the other side. Another world. What did I just do? Coming the wind, the stars, the universe. Being with Aiden and those I've loved forever. Oh, no! I don't want to do that! I don't want to go to heaven! I want to go out with Brian! Shit! Live a normal life, God. We'll eventually see those people, but let's go live. Being in love yeah. Growing old. Yeah, we need that. That's important. So many things I still have to do. Yeah, exactly. Let's do that. Let's do it. Come on, Joe. You know the answer. We'll meet those people on the other side. We'll have plenty of time, but life, life. Of course, life. Is that even a question? Don't worry, we'll see you guys when I die. Just wait for me. You know, you're there for eternity, so just wait. Please. Unless you become new souls and you get reborn in new bodies, in which case you won't be. But whatever, and then you would have been gone anyways in a few years, so let me just... I'm just gonna go live life. Just go live life. It's the only decision, okay? It's the only decision. Unless... Life is really horrible, but we have someone we love here. So why not? Yay! Oh come on, do more slow mo than that. I want to see like the like I don't know little wrinkles on the face, the blub with the slow motion. Okay, fine. Oh, here we go. Nice. I'm so happy the game listened to me. I have powers. Yeah. Woo! It's all over. We, we? We. We're alive. Yeah, we are. Aiden saved the day. Look, she knows. She's like, where's Aiden? Did Aiden sacrifice himself? He did. Aiden? Aiden? Where are you? You're gone. Oh, that's sad. Aiden was there for her. For her whole yeah. life. What a weird feeling that must be. Yeah, but Aiden's gone! Aiden. Well, Aiden went to the other side. I mean, he's he's meant to be over there. He should have been over there a long time ago. He died. <laughs> Touch her shoulder. She'll feel better. Uh, he even touched both her shoulders. It's amazing. The double grab. It's pretty cool. Oh, now he's giving her a nice little hold. Oh, he's good. And then he kissed her shoulder. You get the double double shoulder and the kiss. That's pretty comforting. You know? I wish someone would hold me like that right now. Benson's too small. That's sad. I want someone to hold me like that, okay? Someone just sensually hold me. Well, if this isn't an ending, I don't know what is. It's gotta be the ending, guys. I wonder how long this ending's gonna be. Ooh, we have a cabin in the woods! Yay! Everything worked out after all. Ooh. <gasps> the black sun I'm not looking! Destroyed. Panties! My memory has been disintegrating. Panties! What? I spent too much time on the other side. Really? Now it's eating away at my mind. Really? That sucks. Erasing what's left of it. What? My memories are all confused. Slowly self-destructing. Well, that's why she's trying to remember at the beginning. Dream when you wake up. Okay. I'm losing my sense of time. I no longer know what happened before or after. That's why it's all mixed up in the timeline. I gotcha. It's playing inside my head at the same time. Yeah. But what's gonna happen now? It's like watching the same film looping over and over again. But if it's a good film, it's an interesting film. I mean, you had a crazy life. Images with no order. So I've been writing night and day for weeks. Oh, she's trying to remember it. Put my life down on paper. 
You know what? She shouldn't have said she's writing. She should say, I forget everything. I've been making a video game for weeks. <laughs> I, I even got motion capture and. The investigation continues in an effort to determine the cause of the accident that cost 283 lives. Yeah. <laughs> Pentagon military base. Nathan, you dick. Just killed yourself after opening up the condenser and killing everybody. <laughs> oh, what a fucking asshole. <laughs> The CIA is leaving me alone for the moment. Oh, well, that's good for the moment. I suppose they're too busy building another condenser to worry about me. That's messed up. I know they'll never abandon their experiments. Beyond Two Souls 2. <laughs> know it's on the other side. Beyond Two Souls 2? That's weird. Honestly. Too many twos. I don't give a damn. Now I need to reconstruct my life. Me, me, me. My life without Ida. For as long as I can remember, I dreamt of living without him. Mm -hmm. Untied, without his constant presence by my side. But she constantly relied on him. I got what I wanted. I've never been so unhappy in my life. I feel like part of me has been amputated. Well, he's your twin. I'm crying all day. I know it's stupid. Shit. <gasps> I miss him so much. What is that? It is that the ending I get? I miss him. That sucks. It's miss. Oh, he's alive. It's cool. I'm glad you're alive, Mr. Cole. And not Clayton! <laughs> I got it this time, okay? His name's not Clayton, it's Cole. Hey, friend. Aww. Oh, and there she is. She's in the tree. Maybe she's on the roof. Do you think so? Took months. Months of nothing passing by. That looks so peaceful. I wish I could just make videos all day in that cabin. You know, it was time. Time to start again. To build a new life. It is. Whoa! Decision time! Holy shit! Whoa! Oh my god! Well, obviously, I'm going to choose Ryan. I mean, come on. We have did so much together. We've been through so much. He's one of the only people that I think can truly understand me as a person for what I've been through, even though he did some assholey things. It's so weird. I feel like I'm playing a dating simulator game, but I'm answering this. Like a Japanese dating sim. Okay, well, Jay, no, I didn't even kiss Jay, and I don't want to live on that ranch. Fuck that shit. Ryan. So obvious. Yeah, duh. Well, the way we went. Inside, I, I always knew. I just needed the silence around me. To hear what I was feeling. And then we go back. But she's with another, or he's with another woman. No! It took me a while to realize how much I loved them. That was an important I decision. I sad for so long, I... I've forgotten what it was like to love someone. As his wife gets out of the car, too. Hi! Oh. That's too romantic. I wish he said something like, I'm back, baby! Let's shag. Look at that, now we're gonna live a nice happy life in suburbia. With our ex-CIA boyfriend. Ex-CIA couple! That's cool. It's not even ex-CIA boyfriend. Ex-CIA couple! Fuck yeah. We're both ex-CIA. That's what they can tell the neighbors. The neighbors like, hey, don't step on my lawn. I, I'm big and burly and I do, like, electrician workers. <laughs> We're ex-CIA, motherfucker. I had to learn to love again. 
put my trust in someone. I had to learn to love again. Fighting and running away. It also helped that he had a lot of money and he had a big giant boat and we went out on trips together. <laughs> it was pretty kick ass. I had to learn to live. Ryan and I never talked about it again. Wow. I wish it all never happened. I wish I had a naturally not hairy chest like that. That'd be nice. As if the other side didn't exist. As if it could never come back into our lives. But it will when you die, and that's how it should be. I mean, the other side's the other side for a reason, right? It's not this side. Guys, stop it. I Stop it. Hands above the table. Okay, no hands above. Don't touch yourself. There's no touching yourself going on here. Even though it's romantic, and her bikini bodies, it's pretty good. Mm -hmm. Pretty decent. Give it like a 7.5 out of 10. Okay. They're not kissing anymore. Can I put my hands down? Okay, I'm putting my hands down slowly. Oh, that's a pretty decent side view. Hands up! Okay, it's just the back. Put my hands down. Okay. I'm not doing- SHIT! Is that a coconut? It's an oddly shaped coconut. Crack it open. Ah, it randomly came to Ryan's back there. She's thinking, was it Aiden? What? Really? Still here? Seriously? <laughs> she just has no control over him anymore. I'm... I'm guessing that Aiden decided to just, like, leave her alone to get on with her life, to not rely on him, because Aiden does love her. Or it's another spirit just pretending to be Aiden. And in which case... Wow. Okay, hands above until it pans out a little bit. Okay, good enough, I can't see anything. One sec, I want to add to this mystery sound. Mystery! Is that the end? No! Oh, so much! This this looks totally sci-fied out. Whoa. I tell myself it's only nightmares, but I know it's not true. Once Pandora's box is open, it can never be closed again. What? No. It's not nightmares. It's what is about to happen. Whoa! Holy shit! She looks totally badass. I'm not afraid of death anymore. Ah! What? What? I've gone twice already. What the? Let's go. I must be her, like way in the future, like a different soul, like way, way in the. God, I don't. What an ending! What the hell? I knew there was gonna be some twist, but what? Oh. Okay, well anyways guys, I really hoped you liked the game. I had a lot of fun with it. I thought that they could have designed it a little better. The story was great, but it just needed to be like designed a little better is all. You know, you learn some stuff about how to do like the action sequences and the stealth and you never really use it a whole lot. And it just could have been designed so you, you use those more. It could have been designed so I really wish you had some some control over the um, which events you can see, right? Like if it was like okay, you do a certain something in one event and it unlocks like two different things you can go to that makes sense to like link it together and you can choose so I wish there was a little bit more player input that way and I think it could have been a little bit better if there was 
Uh, but overall, I thought it was great. I mean, the story was great, the acting was great. Uh, the character interactions, yeah, there, there could have been a little more work on that. But it was still, like, it was still good, and it entertained me. I s personally think that Heavy Rain is still a better game altogether. Because in this game, your decisions, they have, like, a little bit of an impact on the ending. But I was noticing, like, I didn't kiss that uh, Native American Indian dude. I didn't kiss him. But I still had the option of, like, going back to him at the end. So it's like my decision not to kiss him just really didn't even matter. You know, it was like, you know, I still had that option to go there. So it just seemed like your decisions didn't really have much of a meaning in this. Like, just small differences with that current event, but not overall in the big picture. Which... Yeah, I think it should have been more like that. Like, in Heavy Rain, the main characters can actually die. You can have, like, your main character die, and then you just don't play as him for the rest of the game, because he's dead! Like, that's insane! That's crazy, you know? It changes the story considerably. Wow. I mean, it, it, a bit. <laughs> but, yeah, I just could, thought that Beyond could have had more of that uh, included in it. Some more decision, player decision, player input. So, anyways, it was still a lot of fun. And I really hope you enjoyed my playthrough. Stay tuned for future Let's Plays from Eric Van Wilderman. Okay? And I know. I know what you're thinking right now. You're thinking, Eric is such a cutie. And I wish I could kiss him. But the best you can do is just pretend. Just look at the webcam footage. And pretend. <laughs> oh, I got nothing. Anyways, I'm peacing out. I I'm gonna let this run. And, uh, yeah, I'll let you watch the credits, and there might be a little something after, and if there is, you'll be able to see it, so I'll catch you later, guys. Peace.